Okay, hello my friend. And then I am planning to show you that how to replace this Toyota cars and like this Toyota Camrys, this cabin areas heater core unit. And this is the unit what changes this uh, what actually heat up this our cars like food area and all other areas and there is this driver seat driver door in here and then when we look in that uh, driver's brake pedal and gas pedal area they are important hints that what we are doing next and then we have this side panel what is in here in that driver's there is gas pedal in here and then when we little bit open that that area in here in that way that I take this mattress away there is this hole and then I move this my mattress a little bit away in that way we can see that there is first this side panel and this is like heat panel because that area we take that plastic panel out and there is some fasteners and screws and then when we look in that area, there is this heater core unit and this is copper, this is a valuable metal, copper, this is like brown and then when we are planning to take that out, we need first flathead screwdriver and then there is really interesting those clamps, they are in here, look, they are copper joints and when I insert this my screwdriver in this one cutting area and then when I carefully I move that in that direction it drops down and there is this this joint connector it goes directly there is two lines in here and that joint goes in this central please look when you take that out that this is the connector and then there is second in this up area and I can also, there is, now we can see that I can take it out and this is really fantastic connector system they, these, these material, they are copper too and this is extremely durable and then these, these pipes, they are quite soft because copper is soft and that's in carefully I recommend that I take my hand in here and then I little bit move there is this joint look and then I move the pipe a little bit away and then normally there is there is this is full of this coolant that please insert in here some uh, canister because there is coolant drying out in this our mattress and I have in here situation that there is now a little bit uh, coolant liquid in this my mattress area and that's remember this is warning message that there is coolant and water inside in these pipes and then I take that lower part also okay and now we can see that there is water drying out and now when this both joints are free I can carefully take this heater core unit and look there is this coolant in there inside now this heater core unit is free and this is really interesting this is copper and we can see that through and and if we can't see that through then we need to replace that and if you can notice in here any leaks leak is normally some corrosion in here then this part must be replaced okay but this is this car's heater core unit and really interesting part and this is copper and this my unit looks very good there's no any issues in this part okay thank you